Rising and shining. We're here at a truck stop. This is our view. Yeah, it's been some loud trucks this morning. Not the greatest of sleep. Uh oh. Jack! Every morning, Jack spills my coffee, the entire coffee. Yesterday, she spilled the entire thing down the sink. You had barely anything in there. Jack, my coffee. There's my breakfast sandwiches. Jay, of course, is playing Clash Royale. Ew, your bananas are in the peanut butter. Jay, your bananas are in the peanut butter. What does that mean? Why are bananas in the peanut butter? Because your spoon's in the thing and your banana's falling. Uh, cleaning up. I've been cleaning all morning, getting no, it all organized. That's why it's looking all good. You didn't help me at all. Jack, you've been spilling all morning. Guys, look at this view outside the window. Look at all of these Hummers. They've got the turrets. I'm gonna go ask if I can jump on one and pretend like I'm just gunning stuff. I uh, pulled the blinds up so we could get a better view. Everyone's just conversing in the convoy. This is a convoy conversation. Now me and Jay are out here in these Philly streets taking a jog. Because we got some time off and we're going to shower, shower, shower. Hope you can hear this. Oops. Guys, look at the size of these sunflowers. Those are the biggest sunflowers I've seen in my whole life. That's like a tree. Just had my first shower in like five days. Feels phenomenal. Here's Jack. So we're here at Jack's Zach's. You guys probably know Zach by now. Family's house. Aunt's house. But all of the family is coming. All of the aunts and uh, all the aunts and uncles will be here tonight. But no Zach. So we got a we got the shower in. We're about to have dinner, and then we're headed to our show in like 45 minutes. Let's see what we got. Oh, meatballs! We got the meatballs. Oh, brisket! Whoa, that burned me up. We got. I'm assuming our gluten free. Wow, that brisket smells amazing. And there's some other dessert. Two desserts. Two desserts. We got the meatballs, the cheese, <laughs> some cream cheese with some pepper jelly. Pepper jelly. Here it is. <laughs> we got the cheesy potatoes. We got the chicken. Some more meatballs. <laughs> and a whole pork sandwich. All right, working it. It's actually underground. Here's their logo. This is not living. This is not alive. Thank you. Is that even work? What's up? Can you get a little bit? Look at that. Michael Michael Castro. So I know this lighting is terrible back here in the green room, but they have one of those pianos that plays itself. I can't find my real camera again. Although I didn't look for it either. But check this out. Check this out. So you can't really see it, but that's the music. There's a bunch of knobs down here that you can't see either. And then there's the pedals and you pump them. Let me switch the tempo here. Let's slow it down. That's a slow. Speed it up. Just disengaged it. We need to put that back. Here's this one. I don't know what that one did. So anyway, having a great time. Alright, somebody tell me what we got. This is a whoopie pie. What'd you say? It's a real. What's real about it? Oh, here, take a bite. Go for it. That's yours. Go for it. Mmm. Where's it from? Yeah, delicious. Lancaster. Lancaster. Real Amish pies. Real Amish pies. This is what an Amish pie looks like. Low quality on the iPhone. There's the lighting that I'm talking about. Mm. Chocolate ones. Yeah, I know. Some jerky. 
So we woke up this morning freezing cold, which is crazy because we turned the heat around last night knowing the temperature was gonna drop. It's 50 degrees. So we get up, it's freezing, go to look, the battery's dead. So battery's dead, very cold. Jay's going to find somebody to jump our car because we have no batteries. I found my vlog cam. It was hidden in this little crevasse. Uh, I was in there in a Starbucks for a while. Jay found someone to jumpstart the car. Then once we jumpstarted the car, the propane was still like halfway full. So it's just that the battery had died. I guess it was reading wrong or something. Anyway, we're all back up and running. Got the propane, still got tons. We got the heater running. Breaking a sweat right in here. Jay's so making cool. some hot coffees. Jack, well, we woke her up. Otherwise, you know. <laughs> Look what we got going on here in Maryland. Big Trump flag. So this room right here is the green room for all three bands tonight. It has this one small couch, that chair, and it has a bunk up there. What? Without Jack. Here's the view out front. Here's the entrance. Kind of hard to find with that little U. U Street music. All right, so we're here in the crowded green room after our show. I didn't realize there were these sick cupcakes. Look at that thick layer of icing on top. You know anything about these cupcakes? What's up? Do you know anything about these? Like, isn't there a story? What's the story? Every time you play the 930 Club or any club that's involved with the 930 Club, they hook you up with delicious cupcakes. And is it always from the same place? Oh, that's why they say 930 on top. I didn't know what it said. They make them? They make these cupcakes and they give you fruits and chips and drinks and drinks and Perrier? That's a first. No one ever hooks you up with Perrier and cheeses. Jay says this is the White House. On the map, it looks like that's supposed to be the White House. It kind of looks like it. But it kind of No way. No. That's way too big to be the White House. No, there's got to be another street. No. Yeah, no, not the White so House, but it's white and it's big. Almost close enough. Thanks, Washington D.C. Look at this! It's like the British Parliament. That's and Congress, then isn't it? I don't know. Jay says that's Congress. Like Congress just hangs out here. And then here's that one big thing from Forrest Gump, also known as what is it? The uh, Jay, what's it called? The Washington Monument. Where's the Lincoln Memorial statue thing? Hey, where'd it go? I totally missed it. There it is. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this Washington Monument. What is that? No. It's just napping on that thing. It's freezing out here. That's the worst place to nap because it's so cold. Look at this. Look at this. Oh yeah, look right, at that. Right the windshield is so greasy, it's blurring the whole thing, but there's that. No, here's this park. We're heading towards here's 17th. the limo. Look at that limo. So, on 17th, look at this. It's got a ton of flags at the base. So blurry because these greasy windows, but flags. Look at this. It's the White House. They put a red cross right on the top. It must be for Christmas. Christmas at the White House. Where's Jack? Here she comes. Every building here looks like the White House. What is this cool? There goes Jack. Can I get What's the door this? Unlocked? Yes, unlock the door. <laughs> That's the White House. <laughs> Mike, you didn't pick it up? Michael, are you Why did you not You're pick it up? Everywhere. Jay, you just dumped it while I was sitting up here and I said, that sounds like you dumped the trash again. So what do you mean, Mike, you, oh, you didn't, didn't pick, pick it up? up? Wow, it's everywhere. It's well, Jay funny. keeps flooring it. I'm not flooring it. Jay's flooring it, the trash falls over. Look at that. That's got to be the White House because they're not letting anyone in there. Look at this. Look at this. That's the White House. Again. Why is my camera always so blurry? Look, look like at this. Parliament. That looks like British Parliament. We got a lot of architectural tips from the British and their Parliament. Where's the White House? Are we, is it, which direction? Wow, that is so cool. And so it's a new day. Uh, making breakfast here. We're about to go to our first writing session here in Nashville. 
We just drove all day yesterday and then went to my friend's house and watched Walking Dead so I didn't film anything. But last night at this truck stop, uh, we parked We parked there two times already on different trips, but this time was different. First of all, in the middle of the night, some guy was yelling about how he was going to kill some other guy and then they sped off in their vehicles. So we'll watch the news and see if that ever came true. And then... <laughs> Uh, like a half an hour after that, this is like around 5 in the morning, someone comes and knocks on Jackie's window and she jumps up screaming <laughs> and it turned out just to be a security guard telling us we couldn't park there at the truck stop in the empty parking lot because we weren't moving cargo. There's a bunch of other trucks all around and they were all allowed to stay but we weren't so thanks TA truck stop in Nashville for nothing. So then I had to get up then at 5 in the morning and drive us to Jay's friend's house where fortunately the land is flat so it's great we're just going to park here the rest of the trip but made some breakfast, I got a breakfast sandwich and I'm going to make chocolate PB and J because I don't only have one breakfast sandwich you know I need two to get going. Got my coffee. Uh, that's it, new song will be written today. It's the first time in a while, can't wait. Also we're late. Where's Jay? Okay, so we just finished the right here with Parker. Totally forgot to film anything. I was gonna film like a chorus or something, but then I didn't. Jack, let's play a chorus. Does anyone remember the words? Jay, you hold this if you don't want it. You hold. Is the first line hung over on goodbye? No, falling out of love is love. Yeah. Ah, thanks. I'm scared of the camera. Jack, you gonna, Jack, you gonna <laughs> come here? So here's the chorus. Can we get oh. Falling out of love is a lot like waking up slowly. Head spinning and lonely. And I'm wishing it was still last night. I'm waking up slowly. You're not here to hold me without a warning. Some morning and I'm hung over on goodbye, waking up slowly. Forgot the lyrics. There you go. Scared. This is Delta. Delta was very excited Delta the whole like time. Scared. scared of the camera though. The camera. Delta, don't be afraid. Come over oh, here. Give him a smooch. Give him a smooch. Go ahead. Give him kisses. Come here, I have a carrot. Delta loves carrots. Come here. That is strange. I wonder why. Scary. <laughs> so, I forgot my camera last night. After our riding session, we went to this really cool event at City Winery, put on by Scott Mulvihill. Uh, it's a fundraiser for a musician's corner, which they put on a co bunch of cool music events. I've played a bunch of their stuff. Um, so, they do a fundraiser at City Winery, so we went and they did a Paul Simon cover night. Tons of my friends played. It was a great night, but I forgot my camera and it was too dark for my phone to film, so that was a huge bummer. Now, it's the morning again. We're headed to a riding session. We're late as usual. Can't find RV parking, so Jay just dropped us off because we're already pretty late, so we can at least tell him we're pretty late. Say, hey, we're here, and then Jay's gonna go find park and have no idea where there's nothing around here. Um, that's it, riding with Josh Williams today. He's the one we wrote Hearts Coming Home with. Through breakdowns and hard luck, you hold my head up. That one, if you don't remember. And Parker yesterday is the one we wrote Head to My Heart With and Good For You. Those two on the record we wrote with Parker, the girl we wrote with yesterday. Phew, it is hot. It is, I mean, the weather's perfect, but just carrying this stuff, I'm like sweating. Jack's up there, round in the corner. Here we are, razor and tie. Look at this, so lucky. So lucky. Someone left and we just drove by, they weren't here now that we walked up. Perfect RV spot. We're taking this, I'm standing here. No one's getting this, not you, not anyone. Not those people over there. Tried to park forward, didn't work, now he's gonna back it in here. Gotta use all the turning radius you can. Look at these guys in the middle of the day on the pedal tavern. That's, what, that's how you do it right there. Look at this sign they put right here so everyone will hit their head. I totally hit my head on it. Look at that. Look at that. Would've just hit my head. What a liability. We're headed to lunch. Walk into barbecue spot. Here we are, peg leg porker. Now open.
open. It's been open for a long time. What do they have that sign for? Peg leg porker. Limpin' ain't easy. Hey, look at that. Dry buffalo wing. Salt potato. BBQ machos. With the mac and cheese, the fries, pulled pork sandwich. It's gonna need some more sauce. Got the sauce. Always more sauce. Yes. Look at this sweet action scooter helmet. It's got an owl flying. Nice. Okay, so, I know, I haven't been filming. If anyone knows, it's me. I'm the one who knows. We did our writing session yesterday. Uh, didn't get too far, got like a verse chorus. And then we were all just really tired. I was just so tired. I've just been so tired all the time. I'm still tired now. We're going to another writing session today. Look at this hair. About to get the dry shampoo out, do some sculpting. Uh, having breakfast. So I went, oh, we went to the grocery store yesterday as well. So I got the classic sausage, egg, and cheese croissant. And then I went with some biscuits too, just to switch it up. It's always good to switch things up when you have the same thing every day. <laughs> Uh, today we're going right with Josh Johnson. He's in a band called Ellen Owen. We've written with him before and we loved what we got but we never finished it. And I didn't show you guys a song from yesterday either. Oh well, you'll hear it eventually. Now we're late. Because we're always late. But Jay got up early so we could be early. <laughs> and now he's still getting ready. Jack, what are you making over there? I'm uh, making waffles. Jack, you want to say it like donkey? You sure? I took a bath. Jay, you want to try? Jay, you want to try? <laughs> like donkey. I'm making waffles. I'm, I'm making waffles. I don't know. None of us are very good. Just got here to ready set. Publishing. Jay brought all his coffee supplies inside. He's gonna make his coffee. His whole bag. His Jay coffee bag. They're singing on a song. This is Trent Dabbs. He's one of my first rides ever when I first got to Nashville many years ago. And you guys probably <coughs> never heard the song or songs that we did, or did they? Trent just sing it a cappella. Against the grain! Re refresh the memory. We did Against the Grain, right? Yeah. Against the Grain. Wasn't that how it was? Against the Grain. I'm going against the Grain. Da, 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 da. So that's Trent. Now he's got this publishing ready set. <laughs> now that now song he finally did something. That song did it. <laughs> did it it charted. Paved the way. That one. Was number 10 on iTunes sing singer songwriter charts when it came out. Ten? We're just talking about the charts. Look at that. Stay Look what on, I did for Trent. On the bring it back around. There it is. Yeah. Ready, set, publishing. So, in a huge plot twist, what is this? Forgot to film again in the session, but we did finish a song. So, what keeps happening is we're there, we're writing, and I'm like, well, once we finish this verse, then I'll film it, because right now it's like half finished, it's not gonna look good. Then we finish, and then we're like, all right, we're done, let's get out of here, and then we leave, and then after I'm like, oh no, I forgot. So that's it, now we're done. <laughs> we're heading out, Jay's out here. Probably can't see him, sure the camera didn't adjust that fast. He is gonna change the generator oil, I'm gonna go stand out there and tell him good job. Um, then we're going to our friend's house to hang out with some other friends, lots of friends hanging out. Then we're going to head out tonight. We're going to drive about an hour. We're playing in Indianapolis tomorrow and we're going to have to get up kind of early tomorrow. So we're just going to try to drive a little tonight, cut, cut down on that drive. Then we're back to playing shows for the next three or four days. And then I think we're supposed to be back home on Sunday or Monday. Which is in three or four days, I don't know. Tomorrow's Thursday, I don't know, whatever. All right, that's it. Whoa, good job, Jay. Whoa. Jay, you need help?